The Roman Catholic faith first reached sub-Saharan Africa in what is now the Democratic Republic of Congo in the 15th century. Contact with Portuguese explorers in the 15th century led to a Congolese nobleman and followers to Lisbon, the capital of Portugal, where they embraced the faith and returned with priests to evangelize the land in 1491, even before Columbus reached the Americas. Under the patronage of the Portuguese king, the church was born in this humid, equatorial country, with the baptism of its ruler, Nazinga, under the patronage of the Portuguese king. The church was born in this humid, equatorial country, with the baptism of its ruler, Nzinga a Nkuru, on May 3, 1491, who took the name of John. It was his queen, Leonor, and later their son, Afonso Mvemba Nzinga, who took great efforts to build churches and schools across the land, and spread the faith by incorporating local elements as well. The church in all its vibrancy as we see it today owes a lot to the efforts of missionaries from Belgium in the 19th and early half of the 20th century. Watch the live broadcast of the Apostolic Journey to the Democratic Republic of the Congo and South Sudan on Shalom World. In Pursuit of Peace, January 31st to February 5th, stay tuned.